So it was the Luigi player also the Mewtwo player from uh, the tournament that Zachary won PSI guy, or is that a different Luigi player? That's disgusting. Why don't Luigi's do that? Did you see what he did? He did down tilt up air, or he did down tilt up tilt up B. What the f <laughs> like? What? <laughs> I've never seen. That combo's own news? I don't see any Luigi players do that. Alright, we gotta watch this. Oh, this is Rizi. Riziasu is using Sephiroth. Interesting. So, in case you guys don't know, Riziasu was the me brawler that won that uh, local. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> he's dead, who cares? But no, he's the, the me brawler that won that tournament over um, Kome and T. So, yeah, he's sick, but he's uh, new to Sephiroth, so he's kind of getting worked right now. Yeah, no, Charlie. I, I've, I've said this, I said this like a, a while ago, but yeah, people people don't want to do it because it's me. That's so disgusting. Hey, up smash. I think he'll get one wing and angel at like 40%, so he could very well make a comeback because Mew is, Mewtwo is pretty light. So I think one more hit, he'll get one wing and angel. He's kind of making a comeback right now, honestly. I think it. Oh, he's fine, right? Yeah. Okay. Damn. Dude, like, okay, there it is. I was gonna say, I feel like it might be in his best interest to just like take a shadow ball so he can get one winged angel. That's death. No, you guys are right. Ooh, why did he? Oh, that could have been so bad for him. I want to say if uh, what's his what's his name grabbed, he could have just up through him. That was such a bad dash attack. That's so, that's so sad. That's so sad. To slice, to slice his butt. Slice the tail off. And the forward tilt, yeah. Forward tilt's just really, really good. That's death, yep. Is Moss on the tournament? I don't know if Moss is here. Oh my god, what the f That was, that was unfortunate. It's so hard to edge guard uh, Octo Slash like that, because the hitbox is gigantic. Forward smash. I was assuming he thought he was gonna teleport. He's getting rolled right now. Although I like he, he was getting rolled in the beginning of the uh, first game, so we can definitely bring it back. Did I just use your vocabulary? What are you talking about? Oh my god. Okay, he is. Uh, that was a sick uh, side B. The command grab. Okay, dash attack kills. Okay. Oh my, these up airs. <laughs> it's really interesting to see Riz Yatsu play uh, Sephiroth compared to Zachary because he's just doing so, like, so many different options. He also just feels like a more, like, un like he has like a uh, more un untamed play style. Because with Zachary, a lot of his moves just felt like very precise and incalculated. Oh, wow. That was so disrespectful. That was so disrespectful. <laughs> yeah, dude. No, nah, no, nah, that, that's, that's, that's peak, that's peak top level gameplay right there. Yeah, I, I think the, the Mewtwo definitely has an advantage going into this because he's kind of, he could have gone off, I feel like. He could have gone off and gone, gone for a fair. I feel like one of the one of the big flaws that Sephiroth has that people aren't taking advantage of just yet is that um his up like the up B he has that's not charged, the hitbox isn't that big, so you can kind of intercept it or like beat it out. It's the octo slash you have to worry about. So if um if you know Sephiroth doesn't have a jump and you know he has to up B, there's a certain point where you can go off and just throw out a hitbox and He's either going to release his up B and run into it, or he's going to uh, charge it and go for an Octo Slash, but you can probably hit him before Octo Slash comes out. Close him up here, okay. That kind of sucked. Ooh. 
He has no jump, yeah. That sucks. Dude, I hate getting hit by that move. There's like certain spots where I feel like it shouldn't work, but like the hitbox is just, it's just so big. I want to say up throw will kill right now for Mewtwo. Yeah. Yeah, he, he's looking for it. He's looking for raw disable. He's looking for it. That's why uh, Rizuatu has his back facing Mewtwo, so he can't get say can't get disabled. Oh yep, he's he's this this person's fishing for it. He is fishing for disable. Wow, really? Oh my God, he read this man's soul. You think he was legit fishing for disabled to scare Rizyatsu and playing scared Rizyatsu show just chuck the that 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 could make sense um honestly. Down smash also has no lag, yeah. Down smash has no lag. It's like it's like Sephiroth down smash though. It's literally like Sephiroth down smash. And he didn't even spam it. That's the funny thing. He he was spamming disable and then he down smashed. It's funny because I feel like the spot where the spot where Lunamato uh did down smash, he could have also disabled and it would have worked still regardless. Because the disable hitbox is, is pretty big. And he went for dash attack, so he was facing him. Oh, are you dead? No, like the rat. Okay, I should. I should. Like the ratchet Japanese Luigi. Oh, it's the mute. Wait, was that the Mewtwo? Or was that. So was the Luigi player also the Mewtwo player from uh, the tournament that Zachary won, PSI guy? Or is that a different Luigi player? That's disgusting! Why don't Luigi's do that? Did you see what he did? He did f down tilt up air, or he did down tilt up tilt up B. What the f <laughs> like, what? <laughs> I've never seen... I just need to see that one more time. That combo's own news? I don't see any Luigi players do that. True non true okay, yeah, okay. Disgusting. Oh, I thought he was gonna beat him. Oh, he went for the down tilt. Oh, he went for it again. Oh my god. That was, yeah, that was, that was so bad. Cause like, it looks like the, the down tilt puts him in hard landing. Oh, he's going Sephiroth? Yeah, that, this makes sense. Cause he can just like forward tilt a lot of Luigi stuff. He can just keep Luigi out better, I feel like. Because he has not only the mobility, but also the speed. And then I think if Luigi misfires, he can just uh, counter it. Or even if he doesn't misfire, he can just counter it. And counter side B. It's planking. Nope. Okay, at least he got the kill there. I was like, oh my god. Uh, uh, oh, it felt so bad if he had lost the stock. Do I think Sephiroth's a glass cannon? I mean, yeah, he dies stupidly early. Like that. <laughs> yeah. He's just glass. <laughs> Counter. Oh, he went for it too. Just missed. This should be death. Too slow. Yeah, where are the four tilts? He, I don't think, he, okay, there he is. I feel like he hasn't been four tilting that much. Bro. Oh my god, he could have down smash there. Yo, and else gaming, thank you. Okay, dash attacks, not gonna kill yet. Okay. That could have been really bad, by the way. That's bad anyways. But I was gonna say that could have been really bad, even though he he killed him with four, uh, he killed him with four air. If he misfired or something, there's a very good chance that he would have died because Luigi's side B has invulnerability frames on it, so he could have like just gone through his four air and killed him. Luminato, I think that's how you say it, say their name. I think something that Luminato is gonna do better than Atelier is uh being is be able to keep out uh the hero when they have like. Psych up or something, just because Mewtwo's so mo mobile and has the ability to just utilize Shadow Ball. Of course, unless Hero puts out Bounce. If he has Bounce, it's kind of I think. Up throw. Yep. Oh god. And he, and, and he has Psych up now. 
And they're dead? Almost. Back air? What? Are you kidding? That's crazy. I wonder if he used Bing. Wait, hold on. I need to see something really quick. Okay, never mind. Oh, I guess he used Bang because he knew that uh, if he air dodged, it would have been more lag. So, Bang kind of was the fastest option he could have done to immediately go back to the menu. I think. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> what percent? He got hit at 32. He got hit at 32 percent and lost his life for whiffing a freaking disable. Yeah, I, I figured as much. Dude, this is so bad. Wow, that's so... Yeah, that's crazy. Okay. It's still... I still think this is over. I don't really see it, see him coming back from this. All he needs to do is, like, psych up and get, like... Psych up our oomph and then, like, just grab him or something. Yeah. Oh, he's still alive? Okay, dude, what's happening? Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, what's happening? Why is this Mewtwo coming back? All right, so we got Bowser. I'm assuming that Luminato just wants like, you know, the uh, added benefit of survivability for being uh, the heaviest character in the game on top of the fact that he can just kill Hero incredibly early. So they can kind of just trade kills because Hero can also kill superly early. And, and Bowser just is just fast, honestly. He's like surprisingly one of the fastest characters. That was back air? Yep. He might be dead. Nope. Zoom. What am I thinking? Dude, I love this hero player's confidence. They're so confident that they'll uh, get the other hit, so they'll burn so much ma mana. Like, they'll burn so much mana, and it's like, you know what? I know I'll be able to get the mana back, because so I'll get the hit. Like, they, they just very. They're very. Are they believe a lot in their abilities? <sighs> Blew up, yep. Sign on kill. I I like that Nair. That was a really good Nair. Oof. Wow, that kill? Get some noms, nice. We 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 eat Good fair kill. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, the wait, like that was disgusting. That wasn't even a read, he just he just waited. Like, so right here, after the nair. So he did the up air. I mean he got the nair here. And then he just waited. He just stood there. And then the person panic air dodge. He panic air dodge so early that it just gave him enough time to just react and just be like, okay, well, drop it. GG's. Oh my god. That was so brave. Oh, something you guys may not know about Bowser, which makes his nair that much more frightening. If he lands with Nair at a certain spot, he can combo into back air. 100% guaranteed. Like, there's, there's nothing you can do about it as long as he gets the right hit of Nair that he needs when he's landing with it. Nice reverse up tilt. You know what I'm surprised about? I feel like this Bowser hasn't really done that many upbeats up out of shield. Which is kind of surprising. Just given the fact that it's, like, his fastest out of shield option. Oh my god! Wait, how did he get that? So he blocked? Oh, he just read a he just read a spot dodge. He just shielded the fair, drop shield, and forward smash. Yeah, he's dead though. That's so good. I really like this Bowser because a lot of what they're doing is just they're predicting they're predicting like the defensive option that's gonna come and then they're just covering it. Rather than like attacking the opponent like right in their face, they're just like throwing out something that they think the opponent's the opponent's gonna do, and then punishing them for it.
Oh, that, yeah, you can't do that. <laughs> you definitely would have just reflected the, uh, side B. He's dead. That was, uh, that was, that was really fun to watch. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, he, he got, he got, he got smacked. But yeah, that was a very fun Bowser to watch. I just really like how, um, he just, he'll just run at you and then he'll just, he'll just pick, he'll just pick an option that he thinks you're gonna do more, more often rather than just like, yeah, he did not help you out of shield that, that much. So like, that shows me two things about, about the Bowser player. It, it shows me that he favors more rewarding options because up be out of shield isn't a rewarding option. It, it like, well, like in terms of damage or getting kills, like it'll get the opponent off of you, but yeah, you're not gonna get that much damage. And then the other thing is that he's also just confident in his defense. He's confident that even without up be out of shield, he's gonna be able to punish you or get something, get something. Up uh, B is a frame 8 option. Frame 8 option, he parried, so that's minus 3. He might be dead. He might be dead. Oh no, he messed up. Okay, damn. Alright, so I might be wrong on this, but like the neutral feels oddly difficult for Inkling compared to other characters, because I feel like normally her, ink, her neutrals is uh, really good against characters, but I feel like versus Luigi, he kind of does well against characters that can't jump in that that good, and I feel like Inkling can't jump in that well versus Luigi, which definitely favors him, because so I feel like approaching him horizontally isn't as isn't that easy. Oh my god, if he got the tech chase there. Yeah, you can't land fair. Well, you're gonna have to like wall back here, but I don't think that's gonna do much for Luigi. It's, it's it's weird. I feel like it's a very, it's a very slow. I feel like it's either gonna be very slow pace, or you're gonna like just make like a super hard call out on something. You're dead. Yo. That 10.1 buff coming in clutch for Luigi, because that that was definitely the 10.1 buff there. <laughs> now nah, we camp Luigi. That's what I'm saying. You either camp or you just dominate him in neutral, like like hard, like you like you just super outrange him. Oh oh my God! I thought he was gonna be able to air dodge. That could have been up B, by the way. By the Luigi, he could have reversed up B. Since the beginning of Ultimate, people knew Luigi's combo game was ridiculous. It it, it, it has remained this way. It has not changed. Nothing's changed. That was interesting. Oh. Good pair or good tech though, even though he missed. That was so sick. Why would they go for that? <laughs> Why the f would they go for that? <laughs> oh, here it is, the Bowser. So I'm not saying this is a bad matchup for Inkling. I'm saying it's like surprisingly not that bad for Bowser, even though he's getting combo right now. Like it's actually oddly not horrible for Bowser. I like he could just oh my god that was it if he double jumped if he double jumped he definitely would have would have back here <laughs> side b probably won't kill yeah next side b will kill though especially if it's near the ledge good wall jump oh my god oh he's dead Yo, that this inkling's sick. Utilizing down throw combos too. He can. Get, oh yeah, he's gonna go for up. So he's gonna go for. He, I mean, Bowser has so many kill mob kill moves at this point. That's death. That's death. Yeah. Okay, I would say this is definitely a, a more better stage for uh, the inkling, can, just given the fact that they have more platforms to 
play around with and then plus the ceiling on a uh, stadium smaller are lower it's lower so up throw <laughs> oh my god but yeah if they if they're able to get up throw up air they have like a, a better window to, to actually like kill bowser with it at kill percent dude these these neutral bees how much how much damage was that they did 24 percent they did 24 percent dead yep Oh yeah, that's the other thing I forgot to mention. Inkling can't rapid jab Bowser because of his tough guy. So it's like one of the reasons, that's like another reason why Bowser does pretty well on it. Like he could just not, he doesn't have to deal with Inkling rapid jab. He has to just do one, two, three. You, you, can, you can still jab. Jab does work. You can do one, two, three. You just can't rapid jab. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I agree. Definitely not being able to rapid jab. Uh, this might be death because of the rage he has. Barely lives, okay. Um, but yeah, not being able to rapid jab is like a, a actually like pretty big because that's how they get a lot of their ability to rack up damage because of the ink they could make upon the opponent. It's fine. Yeah, barely lives, but it's pretty it's pretty over. Inkling is not a comeback character in my opinion. Kills him with jab. That's so funny that, that he just kills with jab. Okay, this is looking really different. I feel like this could be a result of just like the inkling. Oh my god! I feel like the inkling could just be more warmed up because we don't know if the if uh, the Bowser player was playing after his winner's final set, whereas Shiryuki had been playing. You know, he'd been constantly playing. Or maybe Shiryuki just found out something about Ludamato. Maybe maybe a habit because he is doing a uh, splatter shot more. <laughs> this man plays Bowser, Luigi, and Mewtwo. <laughs> those, those are his characters. Oh, that's death, I think. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well... Unless he gets like some crazy Luigi combo, I think that Shiryuki's winning this. this okay, wait, maybe? Wow, okay. Ooh, okay, good. Good not to mash air dodge like a lot of people do. Ooh. I think he's gonna go for the down tilt up, up, or the down tilt up tilt up beat. Or that. Freaking Luigi, man. So good. Dude, he should've, he should, he... <laughs> Look at his face. He's just like, F I had that. Dude, I feel bad because like I, if the Inkling legit just got that one edge guard on, on the Luigi, it would have been it would have been okay. He would have he would have been up 2-0. I think he's gonna say Luigi for the remainder of this set at least, unless he gets bodied. <laughs> These up Bs, he's just finding them. Yeah, it, it's so hard to. Uh, are you not hard, but. At low percent, you can't be off like even even a bit on your combos against Luigi. Okay, Cyclone kill. I thought that was an up B. Cyclone. Yep, that's so smart. That's so smart. He baited it. He baited it. <laughs> that head nod. I feel like that was just like he's like that's right. Your Cyclone or something like that. Like look at that. Look at that head nod. He's like, that's f***ing right. <laughs> he's going Mewtwo? Okay. I feel like this- I feel like this is worse. I feel like he's just cycling through characters now. This man's not afraid to use Disable. He'll- he'll disable multiple times in place and throw out Shadow Balls. This should be a lot of damage. Oh, it misses the up air. 103, yeah. So, yeah, the window- the window's pretty big. Oh, 
Wow, the tail. Hold on. <laughs> oh, this character. That's, yeah, that's gonna kill. Mewtwo's back there is actually really strong. Definitely see this person just going. For, this might be it. Oh. This might be it. Misses. Oh. That was up smash. That was up throw. That was up throw from the. Uh, oh, that's it. Yeah, as soon as. As soon as uh, Shiryuki with the up smash, Lunamato could have just ran and dash grab up throw him, and that would have been game five, anyways. But he gets it in. He gets, he gets the kill he needs to go to game five. Now here's the question, is he staying Mewtwo, or is he switching? He's staying. He's actually staying. He could he could realistically th uh, win this set and then 3-0 him, if he f***s him up. We'll see though. Back throw. Got the two frame. He went for a disable. He like ran back and tried to disable. Oh, he got it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the tail hitbox strikes again. The tail hitbox strikes again. The tail. To be fair, he was bearing, but still, like, look at <laughs> it's still, it just, it just looks so funny, like, he's so far away. All right, so we got a bracket reset. All right, but he goes back to Luigi. That, oh, oh okay, I thought he was going to kill him off of that. A B? I don't know. Oh, of course, that's definitely not an option you want to, you are, Inkling there is definitely not an arrow you want to try to be out of shield. Ooh, things are not going well. Oh my god. Dude, he's just like... <laughs> it feels like he's he's not thinking. It, <laughs> it actually feels like he's not thinking. Like look at this. Like there's such a there's a point where he could just kill them. He could have just like four tilted or done something or forward smash, but he just kept down tilting. He just kept doing it. He just he just kept doing it. <laughs> like look at this. <laughs> he just kept doing it. Men that's definitely mental damage. I, I could agree on that one. I could agree on that one. Yeah, that, that that's some advice for you guys. If you ever want to tilt your opponent, one of the one of the easier ways to tilt someone is just like keep consistently hitting them with the same thing over and over again. Like it hurts more when the opponent knows there's better options they could they could be doing this. Can keep hitting you with the same thing. It's tilting is. Oh, wait, this inkling's really really good. I think the only. The only thing I would I would say the Inkling needs to like just be better at is just get confirming up throw up air. I feel like they've missed it too many times. That's death. Yeah. Four there. <laughs> there he goes, dude. I I I feel like this person. That's almost death. I feel like. Little Mato is is not happy. He lost he lost that first set, and he's just trying to tilt Shiryuki. He's just doing the most tilting things. Up throw, yeah. That that up throw does kill. Dude, this guy is just like I really think he didn't want to lose that first set, and he's just. He's just hurting. He's just, he just wants to hurt this this person. He wants to hurt Shiryuki. He just really wants to hurt him. Oh no! 
Oh no. Okay. Oh, okay. So something I want to I want to bring up regarding Luigi's uh, combo, like. His... <laughs> All right. Something I want to bring up regarding Luigi's zero to death combo. I'm not saying this will guarantee you won't get it, but I think a really good option to kind of make it harder for the Luigi to get the combo is SDIN. Again, I'm not saying it's going to guarantee you get out of the combo. If they react to your Smash DI, you can still get it. Or they can still get it. But I feel like that's kind of... The, uh... A good answer to, to doing it. You can also SDI away, but I feel like SDI in typically works better for me. SDI out and then in. Dude, this is crazy. No! 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 And he popped off! No! Oh no, dude. Evil one today. Evil one today. What was that? You gotta be kidding me. I didn't even expect him to pop off because like he'd been like pretty stoic throughout the entire set. And then he just super grimes on and popped off so hard. And all serious though, good stuff to uh Lunamato, he is really, really good. He has one of the most interesting Bowser's I've ever, I've ever seen, especially at, it's it's especially crazy because if what they said is true, he's the best Bowser in Japan and this dude does not up be out of shield. He never up be out of shield in any of his sets. That's, that's crazy. And then he also has a really, really good Luigi. So that's very frightening. He also has a Mewtwo. It's really interesting to see.